What's up, Aquarius? Welcome to your reading. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It is a general reading. This may or may not resonate. If it doesn't, check out your other placements. Some of the energies of the cards here can be flipped. So feel free to switch those energies vice versa. Okay. And if you need a personal reading, all that information is going to be down in the description box below if I can say that before. Okay. Aquarius, the person that you're dealing with, all right, clearly it looks like you're moving on. Okay. You are moving on. You're finding your own pace, your own harmony. You're just like, you know what? I got no choice. This person's too focused on themselves. Now, the kind of person you're dealing with, right, is someone who's very focused on their career, their goals, their money. Very practical kind of person that you're dealing with, okay? You turn off as someone who was always wanting to nurture his connection, feed this connection. You probably were very smothering is what I'm getting, okay? Trying to nurture and trying to do everything, go out of your way to, you know, make this relationship work out here. Now, what's happening here is that now that you're trying to move on from this person, right? This person out here has now all of a sudden realized that they want to be very generous towards you and they want this equal give and take with you, okay? Now, this person wants to make that move towards you, but the problem here is that they're lacking the confidence. This person has a lot of self-doubt in them, okay? They don't know if they can make it work out with you. That's why it's there on their mind, okay, to probably make this, uh, offer you something more grounded offer you something more stable here because they realize it was a very one-sided connection the problem here is right now you may not see it because this person has a lot of self-doubt okay they have everything that they need but they don't know if they can make it happen with you because i think they mu you must have gone through a lot with this person out here it could have been a very very one-sided situation maybe this person was giving to other people i'm not getting that much here but i'm just getting someone here who's more focused on um say their career, their goals, their money, rather than focusing on making a relationship work out. You, on the other hand here, have come to a point where you've been in your head for a very long time. This relationship has stressed the shit out of you. And when it comes to what you feel, I think you don't give a shit to this person. You're only thinking about yourself. Now you're relaxed. You're being very, very passive. And uh, you're using law of attraction, whether directly or indirectly. That's what you're doing. You're attracting this person back towards you. Okay. And uh, you're losing, you're using the law of attraction, you are constantly giving yourself a lot of self care, a lot of self uh, love out here. And uh, you're being very abundant right now. Okay, you feel you're very comfortably in your own skin. And you are growing, expanding, you'll want a lot of growth, success out here, you could be doing very well financially, very well from working at home or something like that. But I think you're very focused on your career. Okay your finances or just focused on yourself overall I'm getting I don't think you're focused on this person because what's on your mind is that you want to move away from them okay if this person does not give you clarity you just want peace and you just want to do what's best for you and you just want to move away you're physically and mentally trying to distance yourself from this person out here and all this is because this person is not still taking the initiative they want to don't get me wrong they want to take the initiative but self-doubt syndrome right uh, so what this person is doing right now is they're trying to just focus on their money right now. Okay, why? Because if you see this, right, this is a direct connection. They feel they can't work, they could work out with them. So they'd rather focus on something that will grow rather than focus on this connection where they feel at least for the next 10 days, they can't make it work out here. The mutual energy between you both is that you're both wanting to make this work out. Okay, I mean, you guys know that you guys, I mean, are badass together. So that's there. But um I think you're waiting for this person to take the make the move out here. If they don't, you're walking away. If not walking away, at least you're mentally, physically trying to distance yourself from this person for the next 10 days here. The action you plan on taking is nada. You're taking no action, okay? Because you're emotionally very stuck on the past here. I have a feeling you don't trust this person out here. Um... You have a lot of compassion for this person, okay? Uh, if not compassion, at least you have feelings for this person out here, right? But you're just feeling stuck. You feel like you can't do anything about it, okay? This person out here, the action they plan on taking is they want a reunion with you. And I feel this person will reach out. They will reach out. I feel there is going to be indirect communication between you and the person you're dealing with, okay? There is going to be some indirect communication here. 
and eventually in the next 10 days there is going to be something that's going to be of uh, significance to you okay i feel this person will reach out to you here because now this person realizes what they really really want this person honestly had a very imbalance here okay i think this person was very focused on a sexual relationship they were running out from commitment or they were just very focused on the materialistic aspects of life now they realize that they need to balance things out and now they're more in that commitment mode more in the mode where they want to balance things out see those cards here but the thing is that they're trying to distract themselves from trying to work on themselves out here okay they're trying to work on manual details of what went wrong here is also what i'm getting here whilst you are trying to distance yourself from them okay and the reason why this is happening is because you're in your power okay that's fine if you're not doing anything about it. I mean, you have reached that point of where earlier if you were emotionally very unstable and you were letting your emotions or logic, one of them overpower the other thing, I feel now you've reached a very balanced uh, situation here and you're mastering your emotions here. Eventually, I see the best possible outcome the next 10 days, this person's going to reach out to you, okay? And the good thing is they're going to reach out to you with something more grounded, with some potential, okay? It's not like a lame-ass page of cups with an apology or not like more like just watching you and stalking you, okay? And not like something where it's like uh, more passionate. I feel this person is more grounded out here, could come off as very mature to you, but at least that's how they want to start off with because eventually their aim is the lovers out here, okay? That's what's on their mind in their action part here. So yeah, because they're, I mean... I'm very glad to see that they will take action towards you because now they're realizing that you are the one for them. Okay. So that's what I have for you, Aquarius. Hope this reading resonates. Leave your comments below. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.